So this is Air Control. I've heard horrible things about this game. So let's give it a try and see if it's as bad as everyone uh, says it is. Apparently we air controlled our plane into the ocean. So already a bad start. The plane already crashed before I got a chance to play. Well, let, let's just play uh, casual mode, realistic. Let's do realistic mode. Why not? That's some really loud music. And um, okay, so I'm the plane, I guess. And I press space to launch engine, and the um, the arrow keys basically turn. Let's let's try that. Oh my God! It's so loud! I I can't turn. I can't turn. I can't turn left and right. I can only go. F I can only go forward, and when we rode into that green square, I guess that was the first level. The point of that first level was to uh, drive into the green square directly in front of you. Um, I guess the game has great art. I mean, this looks good. <laughs> the loading screen is very impressive. I just wish the actual game was like that. It's taking taking quite a while. I believe it's actually frozen. Yeah, um, the game, my game crashed. So my game just crashed. Let's restart. Uh, maybe we rode into the green square a little too fast. Okay, no. Okay, game's back now. Okay. Welcome aboard, and thanks for flying with us. We're committed to making your flight Where are all the people? So before we depart, we'll be They, a they just took emergency. off without any this people. Can help you if an They're losing a million dollars for this flight. Even if you are. They forgot to put a bunch of passengers on board. All should now be stored securely. Either in an overhead bin... Who's talking? Is this a haunted airplane? There's no one here. There's no one flying. Oh my god. And other electronic devices should be turned. Okay, can I just want to skip this. How do I turn this tutorial off? Electronic devices. But note that some items such as phones may not be in flight at any time. You'll find a list of approved electronic devices in the in-flight information section of Sky Magazine. All right, fine. Let's go. Oh, another load screen. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's a beautiful load screen. I got to give the game credit. Oh, we're air control not responding once again. So every single load screen, uh, the game will uh, periodically crash. And then I guess I have to wait for it to uncrash itself or I don't really know how it works. Look, I'm not a I'm not a game developer, but I'm pretty sure the game is not supposed to crash every single load screen I, I don't know maybe there's it's there's some kind of like mini game where uh it, you have to like see how long you can wait for the game to come back so here we are waiting for the the game that is not responding right now just like the first time and um uh, spinning spinning let's just oh here we go yeah the game was not responding but now i'm in the gameplay now the, at least now we're the um the plane is filled with passengers and oh my god look how big i am i'm like a, a nine foot tall stewardess can i get you a drink sir can i get you a drink madam sir will you be having the halal special fee fi fo fum i smell the blood of an english passenger well there they're all like frightened. Look, they're all just staring perfectly forward. They're scared of the 12 foot tall stewardess walking around. Looks like I already ate one of the passengers. Uh, hello, sir. What are you What are you watching there, sir? What do you have? Oh, okay. It It looks just like a, a, a frozen uh, picture. I, I think this guy's watching the loading screen of this game. Uh, sir, is your loading screen not responding for your in-game gameplay? Of the air control. Well, let's go visit the cockpit. Oh, uh, look, that's my favorite movie they're watching, Forrest Gump. All right, so where are we going now? Let's get some stuff. I don't know. Well, how do I do anything? What What am I supposed to do? Close. Closed. Okay. So did I just close the door? Did we take off with the door open? Is that what happened? I don't know. Okay, let's just. There's something green. Maybe I should close that door as well. Oh, I just went through the uh, through the TV. All right, let's close this door as well. What are we doing, flying with open doors? Everybody, all right? What are you What are you looking at, sir? Look at this guy. Look at him. What is he staring at? Like just 
He's looking intently at this glass. Oh my god, these people are freaking me out. Even the children are weird. Look at these children of the corn. Little Justin Bieber and Selena Gomez over here. Alright, off we go. <laughs> it's just a baby! It's a frozen baby! <laughs> Look! The baby is frozen! What is it? Is, do you see your mommy on TV? Are you watching Cops? Alright, I guess let's close this door too? I don't know. Close. Alright, I don't... Is this what I'm supposed to be doing? Just closing doors? Okay. I don't know. There is a lot of people on this plane, and they're all frozen. It's like some kind of horror movie. It's like the, the Langoliers 2, where I'm on the plane, and everyone is frozen. Well, you know what? Let's just go visit... Why am I so, walking so slowly? Let's visit the, um... How do I... How do I even open doors? I don't even know. I read the controls. It's like the mouse button does stuff. Other buttons do a little... Okay. Um... So this is a... So far, it's just a great walking around the inside of a plane simulator. That's what it is right now. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. The only gameplay was controlling the plane. I wasn't able to go left or right. I just went forward into a green square for two seconds. And then we had 57 hours of load time. And now we're inside the plane and we don't know what to do except come up to doors and close them. I don't know. I need a seat. I'm gonna take a seat. Uh, look, that guy's that guy's melted into his seat. He's been sitting there for uh, for two million years. Let's look at. Uh, there's something on the plane. Can I duck? What is there a duck? Oh, I can jump. All right. Let's hippity hop along. If I see my steward is jumping around, I'm gonna think something's wrong. All right. So now we're at the back of the plane. This is where all the dumb kids sit. Uh, you guys want to smoke some reefer after school? Look, look at, where is that guy sitting? It, he's just, <laughs> he's sitting on this woman's armrest. <laughs> this is the really economy seats. <laughs> he just paid 20 bucks to sit on her armrest for the entire flight. Oh, man. They must be going to Kansas City. All right, let's see here. I don't even know why I said that. I just that's that's just a backhanded insult to Kansas City. I don't know why. I have no idea who lives in Kansas City. Oh, look! Now we can see the outside of the world. There's the plane, and um, not much in terms of like clouds or just space or anything. It's just like a negative zone and this plane. And yeah, there's nothing. Absolutely nothing. And I don't know what to do or where to go. You know what? Maybe this mode is broken. Let's just try a different game mode. Okay, here we are back in the water. You want? You guys want to try Killjoy mode? Or honestly, I bet every single one of these modes is, is a Killjoy mode. But let's try casual mode. Maybe that'll be. <laughs> what the hell is this? Ragnar Lothbrok stars in air control. Conan, what is best in life? To fly the airplane and to hear the lamentation of the stewardesses. Alright, I don't know. What the hell? What? Oh, great, like... Sector 7 music from Final Fantasy. WASD to walk, left shift to sprint? Why do we need to sprint? What the fuck was that? What was that? What, what, there was like a bunch of Vikings sitting around a, a fire, and now we're in the plane again. What are all these buttons? What the fuck? I press on this button, and my mouse moves to a different place. Oh my god. What the fuck? Disable lock cursor UI. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. All right. Now, in the last game mode, uh, the space button made me jump. Look what it does now. It, the space button just makes me twitch to the right a little bit. What the fuck kind of- What is this for? What? 
<laughs> this game is ridiculous! Maybe it's for like dancing to the music. This is the dance mode. This is the Parappa the Rapper meets Airport Control Simulator or whatever this game is called. I already forgot. There's a clip on the ammo meter. For what? I don't I don't even have the controls to shoot! I have an ammo meter and no gun and no controls to be able to shoot a gun. And of course, of course the pilot isn't actually touching the the thing that makes the plane fly. I don't know what it's called, a steering wheel. I don't care. Don't I uh, don't tell me. I don't care, really. This game is not worth it. Post nothing of relevance or importance in the comments. The only thing I want to hear in the comments is how bad this game sucks. We can walk through walls here, I guess. Oh, there's there's an empty liquor bottle. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. Madam, I've asked you before, but get off my plane. All right, you know what? Let's try the other, the third mode. See, maybe the third mode makes a little more sense. I would guess it doesn't. Okay, we have two modes to try. Casual mode part two and killjoy mode. Let's try casual mode part two. I don't know why. What the fuck? What is happening? Okay. What? What? It's, it's Flappy Planes! We're playing Flappy Planes to the wonderful sounds of an Eastern European ukulele wedding. Planes are not supposed to jump. Is this one of the lessons from aviation school that we have to learn? Alright, so... At least this is a game, though. I mean, it has horrible controls. It's ugly beyond belief. But at least this version of the game is a game. So, my hat's off to you, air control. One... This, this is the one part of the game that's actually a game. I paid six dollars for this! Six dollars! Oh. Alright, let's try the last mode. Okay, so we have exactly one gameplay mode left, which is kill the Killjoy mode. I'm assuming coming soon is not a gameplay mode, but who knows with a game like this. So let's just try Killjoy mode. Here's a large uh, loading screen. Okay, it's not that long anymore. Uh, but whenever we do go into a loading screen, the game crashes. So uh, I'm, I'm waiting for the game to crash again. Go ahead, crash. I know you're going to crash. Look, I know you want to crash. Just crash. I can wait a minute or two, and then we'll get to the gameplay. It's fine, game. I, I know. I know you, it has to be done. I Just go ahead and do it. Get it over with. I'll, look, I'll turn away. I will, I'm literally... Look, I'm turning... I just... If, if there was a camera pointing at me, if I was doing one of those PewDiePie Let's Plays, and there was like a camera on the top left, and I was screaming in broken English at, at the game screen, you would see that my, my chair has turned away from the computer. So go ahead, game. Crash. Do your business. It's do your private crashing business. Okay. Um, this is a very long loading. Okay, here we go. Distance to goal, 18218 point. Okay. So space to launch engine. Why to fly up when plane is ready? WASD to turn, C to change view. Okay, let's do this. Oh my God, it's so loud. Oh my God, this game. Everything is broken! Am I... Uh oh, oh no, that's not... Are planes supposed to fly like this? We're flying straight up! What? Okay, everyone, everyone relax! Everyone be cool! Uh oh, no, no! Okay, um... So, alright, look. That wasn't the perfect landing. I'm gonna be honest. I had a few shots of whiskey before I, I, I went up to fly. But um at least everyone is safe inside and uh we can just fly again, right? So let's oh no, the plane's broken. Okay. Um so yeah, we, we tried to fly and uh the plane just went straight upwards, like at a straight angle instead of like at like a just gradually going upwards. I don't know what I did wrong. I don't... Well, I know what I did wrong. I bought this game. That's what I did wrong. Uh, let's change the cinematic view. All right, this is much better. The wing view. Uh, C to change view. Um, 
Okay. Oh, where the inside of the plane? This is a great. Is everyone okay, sir? Are you okay? Because, sir, you seem a bit shaky. You're all right, sir. Is everyone all right? I think everyone is okay, except they're all very, very shaky, and I can't start the plane up again because I think the engine broke. But uh, the important thing is we got to our destination, which was 20 feet. Uh, that'll be $2,000 from all of you. Uh, so here's my, I guess, uh, rating of air control for the PC. This game gets an official Stan Birdman rating of a what the flying fuck out of 10. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, my friends.